<laughs> we can just make them up ourselves. All right, ready? Howdy folks, the great folks of Monaco. Well, actually you could be elsewhere watching this edition of On The Sofa. But if you are in Monaco, lucky you. Simply lovely. <laughs> All right, so we are here in Monaco, if I didn't say that already. <laughs> and With the background, I think we are in Monaco. We're doing some questions now, so I'm gonna start. That's me, Daniel. That's Max. I ask Max a question. How yeah. do my glasses look? What are we saying? Honestly, to be, to be honest, <laughs> when you were standing there, I was like, who's? Glasses has he put on just for fun. <laughs> but no, they, they actually look amazing. I feel quite sophisticated. <laughs> I don't know, I just feel like someone smarter than I really am. What's life like being Daniel Ricciardo at the moment? Annoying. Yeah, is it? Beautiful, but annoying because everyone is like, what are you doing next year? I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, seriously, I will sucker punch you all in the throat. So annoying, but it's good. I like it, I like it. It's, it, it normally is a good thing. Yeah. Instead of like People asking care. you, are you still in F1 next year? That's true. So I shouldn't complain. I'm not complaining. The view we've got's amazing. So life's good. Oh, this is a good one. I like this. Mm. What's your favorite smell? Yeah, this maybe sounds a bit odd, but I, when I was like eight years old, I loved to smell fuel. Oh yeah. Yeah. Like a go-kart track. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's so good. Even now when you go back, like the two stroke. Yeah. Oh, it's so good. Oh, I think that's one of my best smells. Yeah, I actually, I, yeah. I think I'm up there as well. Yeah. Vanilla and <laughs> okay. race and two strokes. Right. <laughs> Fuel. Daniel, what's the last dream you remember having? Good question. You know what I have sometimes? Like I Tell dream me. that I'm falling yep. and then it stops and then I'm falling again. So it just keeps falling. Like you fall wow. and then you're like, ah, oh, it stops and then Oh, you keep falling again. <laughs> Sounds like a good roller coaster. Yeah, but it just, it's so odd. You're like, oh, and then you want to hold on and then suddenly it stops. Like, okay. I get ones where I'm running, but I can't run fast enough. Like, so I'm running, but it's like I'm running at walking speed. Yeah. So I can't like, yeah. get away or get to where I need to go. So it's like, I don't know, it's frustrating. It sounds a bit like you're falling. Yeah. And I'm free. What am I doing, Max? Falling. That's it. Yeah. All right, what do you love most about Monaco? Um, I actually like coming home and spend time on the jet skis and stuff. Yeah. Now, yeah. All right. That's the best thing about Monaco. And normally I would say the good weather, but it hasn't been that great lately. It's actually it's, starting it's, it's to dripping. rain. It's like literally If the dripping. cameras can't pick it up, it is starting to rain. These glasses are so sophisticated, they actually can tell you at what rate the precipitation is falling. <laughs> is it your turn? Uh, your turn. My turn. What's the best race you've ever had? And it doesn't have to be an F1 race. Oh, okay. I mean, well, the victory in F1s are always fun, but let's go, let's go left to field. I will say June the 10th, 2008, Silverstone race two, Formula Renault Euro Cup, me versus Valtteri Bottas, passed him on the last lap, Kiki <laughs> for the race win. June, the you remember everything? Yeah. Wow. It was really hot. I think I hot. saw that really... race on YouTube. Yeah, it's probably there. It was yeah. a good one. Because he dominated all weekend and even he was on pole. He pulled away at the start. And I don't know how, but I just like hung with him. And then last lap, he like blocked and I was able to get him. So thanks, Valtteri. Nothing's changed. Where have you traveled in the past year and not for work? Uh, Ibiza. So I'd never been. I always wanted to go and I finally went. And yeah, I'll go again for sure. That was cool. Safe. I like that. Same for me. Yeah. Ibiza. Also Ibiza, yeah. It's a cool place. Yep. Alrighty, what's the dumbest thing you've done at work and not told anybody? Things, you know, which you might have done, but then you can't tell anyone. Have you farted in my helmet before and not told me? Um, I have not done that yet, but thank okay. you for reminding. No worries. So that's very good, actually. <clears throat> Who do you think has got the easiest job in the team? I think the marketing team that works with me, easiest for sure. <laughs> the team that works with you, <laughs> I mean, they should get double paid. Yeah, really? For sure. Yeah. Are they doing that well? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, our trainers have a pretty easy time, don't they? I think my, my trainers, um, he is doing other stuff on the side. Money laundering. In every country Michael's a good kid, just kidding. Michael's blessed. Hashtag. Sorry, Lewis, copyright. You own a Formula One team. You can pick two drivers, past or present. Who would you pick and why? 
You oh. can't pick me, you, or your dad. My mum. <laughs> <No. laughs> um, okay. Now I would. Okay, I would like to work with Senna. Just. Yep. Um, and the second one. Yeah, maybe Schumacher and Senna in one team. Don't you think? Or like James Hunt actually. Can we have three drivers in the team? <laughs> James Hunt would be cool. Wouldn't be good to manage him though, because he would be hard work, but that would have been no, cool. No, it's, it's easy going. I'm like, you just rock up whenever you like, son. <laughs> I mean, I'm easy going as well. Jump got a in the car. car. So, all right, James Hunt and who's currently on the grid? Oh, Lance Stroll. I saw boat, his boat out boat. there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's get Lance on the team. Sir Lancelot, I'm signing you up. My turn. Apart from our jobs, what do we have in common? Not much. I mean, I've got good looks, you don't. Uh, I'm naturally talented in other sports, you're not. Um, you can ride a jet ski. You're I not. probably can, but choose not to because I do better things. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Look, we're old enough. We like a beverage or two. I like yeah. a, I like I'm a, almost old enough in America as well. Almost, yeah. I'm getting there. Nearly. Yeah. I mean, a stiff beverage feels good, doesn't it? We enjoy having a good time. Let's say that. We like... We like letting loose every now and then. Yeah. You've set a few fastest laps this year. Do you get a bonus for that? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Why would I mean, you put it's this? nice. <laughs> yeah. There's a little bit of a, a little bit of a hey, good job. Got to get it while you can. Yeah. Yeah. Get it. Ah. How many have you got already? Two or three? Three. Three. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I better need to up my game in that. <laughs> guys, guys, I run out of tires. Please, box, box, two laps to go. <laughs> yeah, you can't do it like that because then they're like, why'd you come in? And then you go fast. <laughs> they're like, we're not giving you your yeah, bonus. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, Max, what posters did you have on your bedroom wall when you were young? Okay, so that had nothing to do with racing. I had uh, a world map. World map? World map. And really? all the flags so from all the countries with the capital... Uh, so you just wanted to country. know a bit about the world? Yeah, and no, yes, yes. But then also I played a game with my, my sister, guessing where countries were. Seeing though you've brought up this uh, thing about the maps. Oh no. Reel them off for me, this Max. Is, this was, wait, other way around, other way around. Uh, same thing. <laughs> Germany. Oh, what's this one? I don't know that. That was not on my map. Well, it should is, be. Is it, is it like a recently added country or something? Micronesia. That's why it's so, it's so small, mate. Micronesia. You see it on my map. Wow. Did, they, did something go wrong with the printer? <laughs> this was not on my map. This is like a recently I mean, added I, country. I'm going to say like uh, Papua New Guinea or something. No, no. Bangladesh. That's not a country. I mean, that map did absolutely nothing for you when you were a Yeah, kid. but honestly, I mean, you you know this? Look at it, look at it. Of look course I know that country. Uh? Of course I do. Bhutan. Bhutan. I think this is Bhutan. Bhutan. What about this one? That's, I know that one. Senegal? I would have said Cameroon. Oh, Burkina Faso. It's not Cameroon either. Burkina Faso. What? Oh, this one I know. <laughs> I think I know this. And I, yeah. Uh, Cuba. I would have said the same. Is it Cuba? Nice. Oh. Macedonia. Macedonia? Yeah. Okay, he actually is pretty good. He's still a squid, but. I, I honestly, I don't know this one. Togo, but oh, that's not even in Africa. Wow, Portugal. Portugal. Wales, I see it straight away. Yeah. Wales. 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 Ooh. New Caledonia. Is that even a country? Made it up, sound good. I, don't, I, I guess it's somewhere around Australia and that area. Hawaii? Is it Hawaii? Hawaii! <laughs> no way. Really? Yeah. Get it. Greece. Get it, girl. Greece. Greece. <laughs> he knows it. <laughs> he was going to say Australia, but he knows <laughs> exactly. it's New Zealand. You were really... Yeah. I know. I know. Denmark. Oh, they're playing the game as well. Are you from Denmark? You're from Denmark? Oh, otherwise I was going to say be quiet. <laughs> oh yeah, Baku. Welcome Baku. No, it's not Baku. Azerbaijan. There you go. Au revoir from Monaco. Daniel Ricardo. And the, Max uh, Verstappen. The geography guru, Max Verstappen. Or as they say, uh, Maxime Verstappen. Maxime. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>